the woo in the wild. Good morning, everybody. Vlogmas day six. Sorry, my other hand is holding my camera. <laughs> so, good morning. I am tired. I worked a late shift last night at the Cornerstone. I gotta turn around and do it again today. And I also have stuff I have to get done beforehand. Like, take this little doggy for a walk. <laughs> oh my god, she's not. I swear, I swear, she's just a princess baby, but look at her. She's nuts. Walk time? Okay. dogs kick like that just got done with the doctor and all of that and uh, basically I'm supposed to I have to quit my job <laughs> I shouldn't even go to work tonight <sighs> I my steering wheel is dirty okay now I gotta go to the oh I wasn't even recording yeah I only have an hour before work Steering wheel is filthy. Haven't even eaten yet today. And yeah, I'm supposed to just, I'm supposed to quit. I shouldn't even, again, I shouldn't even be going in today. So, it's frustrating. Oh, my mommy's home now. Oh, it's okay, my baby girl. We well, got an elephant? You know, that's mommy's favorite, huh? Do you have an elephant? Oh, we girl, I missed you so much. <laughs> I had to put the wide angle lens on to capture all of your cuteness. There we go. I have to eat and go to work, even though I'm not supposed to. <laughs> Okay, so I uh I was legit rushing to try and get to work and um because of how bad I feel and um the amount of pain I'm in and just my mental state because of all of that, like not getting any sleep for the last week, being overworked at work, like the work we're doing I've been doing is been meant for four people. I've been doing it all alone. Um I just you know what I mean? Anyways, I'm just trying to think about stuff right now because I legit told my, because I told my boss I cannot come in tonight. You know, I understand it's a Saturday, but I've done that by myself in the very beginning when it was a lot busier. We also have no food to sell, so it would just solely be just beverages. That's all that would be getting sold tonight. Beverages, that's it. So like it would, a normal $4,000 night is now a $1,000 night. I've done that by myself many times. There's other girl working there and I'm just like, I cannot work tonight. I need time to rest because I've been, they've been overworking me. And it sounds silly because I only work a few days a week, but I have multiple sclerosis. I'm not supposed to work that much. And when I do work, I'm not supposed to be on my feet for eight hours a day or a night. Like, go, go, go. Like, you have no idea the amount of steps I put on in a night. And I don't ever get a break. I don't get to sit down. It's not, it's not like that. And that's not good for my health. But they've been just like, just stick it out. Just stick it out. And it's going to get a lot better. I understand that. But I can't continue to do all this work by myself. I'm not healthy enough for that. So right now I'm frustrated <laughs> because I'm in a lot of pain because of that. Um, like I ran around all this morning trying to get stuff done, going to the doctors and getting, doing, I did some grocery shopping because I have no food. I don't know why I keep touch. I'm like self, you know, like caressing, like, don't worry, it's going to be okay. <laughs> just a little self love here. Oh my God. But I just, I let my manager know I cannot come in tonight. Um, doctor's orders, like I am not supposed to be working, period. I'm like, at least not like this. I need to find an office job or a job where I'm sitting all day and or at least like I have a balance where that's why I love YouTube and vlogging because I do have a balance there I can go out film at the park for like an hour or two go at my own pace sit down for lunch take my time go on a five minute ten minute ride you know what I mean like I'm not on my feet all day when I'm at the park come 
back here, edit. I'm sitting the entire time. I'm completely fine. I've been doing that now for like eight years and it has been very good for me. I've just never like pursued it strongly enough for it to be a career for me but now i'm getting more like hungry for it like i want this to be my job i love like doing this and filming and i like oh i really love doing road trips and going to like abandoned places and spooky places and obscure places and like everything in between and i love all of that and capturing it on film for everyone to see and for like prosperity like you know so it's forever there for people to see be able to look back on for the archives for humanity's archives anyways so i yeah i got off tangent oh yeah so yeah i quit <laughs> my job i was legit get like i got my makeup on i was legit getting ready to go and like i said i had a meltdown and um i started freaking out and i was in, i'm in so much pain and i'm just like all i want to do is just sit and go to bed i just i know how my body feels i need to rest and i let my manager know like hey i'm not coming in tonight i have to rest um there's just no way i can come in i'm so like i'm paralyzed like I've been, it's the best way to put it. It's, I'm going off of fumes right now and my body just wants to shut down. Last night I worked way too hard and I honestly don't get paid enough there anyways to for how much hard I work. I'm just like, no, oh, this is not worth it. This is not worth how my, how my body has been feeling since I started working here and how my, like my arms are going, my arm, like I said in my last vlog, and I know a lot of people aren't watching these little vlogs, whatever, but my arms are going numb and my feet are going numb and my face has started going numb so i'm having attacks everywhere and it's a sign of me not resting enough i know my body so it's one of those things where i'm sorry i really want to help out as much as i can but i just i can't do it at the expense of my health and i understand they're strapped but it's not my fault it's not my problem in a sense I've been helping out as much as I can and I'm a very hard worker I just I have to think about myself and and in this situation like I don't want to devolve like I don't there's a lot of stuff there's a lot of stuff behind the scenes there that I haven't been sharing maybe a little tit tits and bits here and there but I'm not getting into depth yet or at all it's just uh, it's, it's a lot and it's very stressful for me and I'm not supposed to have stress that much in my life especially stress that's not mine it's just stress like I inherited as soon as I started working there people were like divulging everything to me all the negative stuff to me about everything so I just a lot for me to take on and I took it all on but then we're being overworked to the point where I can't do anything. I'm so exhausted. Today was the first time I got to actually go get groceries in a long time. Like weeks. No food. Anyways. The reason why I'm making this a long outro and whatnot is... And no one's going to watch it anyways. And the people that do watch it, very sorry. Very special to me. And it means a lot that you are watching this. But it's because I know I'm rest of the night is going to be nothing for me. I'm going to bed. In fact, when I wake up, that's when I'm going to edit and post this. But right now, it's like 12 after 2, or after 2, whatever. I'm going to bed. I'm exhausted. I'm going to take my makeup off. I just don't, like, I've done so much for a company that just doesn't has not cared about me. It's not even thought about, I mean, I've been working there a month, and I finally have someone helping me on the weekends. And this snowfall has been going on for a month now, so... Oh, yeah, almost a month, but it's close to a month. Just can't can't maintain anymore. But I fought a good fight for a long time. Just can't do it anymore. I need I need to rest. So, anyways, <sighs> all right. I will see you tomorrow for Vlogmas Day Seven Six. Oh my God, what day were we on? Six Seven. We're on six today. Today is six. No. Yes. <laughs> I think this morning my intro I said day five, but we're on six, baby. I'll have to correct that in post. I'm very tired. All right. <laughs>